You guys know what I'm doing? Mixing them up. Tossing a conversation salad. Oh! Hey guys, welcome to Table Talk. My name's Joe Beretta. I'm William Haynes. And I'm Raina Scully. This is Raina's first Table Talk, everybody. Give her a hand. Give her a hand. Give her a hand. Uh -huh. there you go. See, That's what I, I, I what you did, I did it literally. Yeah, yeah it was good. Yeah, you took what I a said. play on words. Yeah, we had fun. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you guys know what we do here. You give us topics via the hashtag Table Talk on the Twitter or over on our subreddit, r slash sourcefed, in the uh, Table Talk yeah. conversation over there. And we took a lot today. Good lord. We could talk about anything. Yeah. Ugh. Literally anything. What do you want to talk about? Mm, I want, well, I don't know, whatever subject. Oh, oh snap. I need to go first. I didn't know that's what that meant. The ball to move. Gentlemans. Gentlemans. We're gentlemans. Oh. What you got, girl? Animus BCC asks, um, what's something you've thought of you think nobody really has? Mine is you always notice when you're tired, never the opposite. Oh god, I'm really awake right now. <laughs> what, I, uh, yeah. <laughs> what's something you've thought of that you think nobody really has? Something you've thought of? That I think no one has. I mean, the last, I've, I've talked about this recently, so I hate to bring it back up, but mine was the whole, uh, I had a little bit of flack for it, like, do you guys see the same red that I see? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, do people say, like, if I smell something, oh. the, the smell of lasagna, let's say, yeah. is the smell of lasagna to me. I wonder if it's the same exact smell to somebody else. Like, when you're seeing that red, mm -hmm. are you seeing the same you, red as me, or is your red a little bit blue? I went to this oh. place that had a bunch of science stuff mm -hmm. in San Francisco, and it showed you, like, this thing with orange, and apparently everybody sees colors just a little bit differently. It's the same thing, but a little bit differently. But how do we know that? Exactly, how, yeah. do, we know? how do we know? I mean, we do it with taste. Like, I can't stand the taste of pickles. Pickles, but people love pickles. Maybe them, maybe them people like are tasting either, a slightly right? different yeah. pickle than I'm tasting. You don't like eggs. Maybe my pickle is your dog food. You know? Is dog food that bad though? Hmm. Dog it depends food. on your taste. I've tasted dog food. It is surprisingly bland. Um, it doesn't taste like much. You've never tasted it's dog It's rocks. Food? It's rocks. We feed them rocks and we wonder <laughs> why they're so... Well, <laughs> That's not <laughs> true. Have, have I ever tasted dog food? I'm sure I have at some point. Did you taste like a like a milk bone or did you get like no. the Campbell's no. soup A uh, Gross. No, I didn't do that. Food. I didn't do that. Um, I tasted a milk bone and then I tasted like a tiny puppy chow because I, I don't know. They're, they're, you just wanted to know. I just wanted to know. Um, but wait, back on the color like uh -huh. thing that we were talking about. I'm actually red green colorblind. Oh really? Yes, it's really rare in girls. They used to think it doesn't happen in girls. Um, and Ooh, so I that was... epic mealtime poster over there looks a lot different to you than it does to me. Do you see bacon? Because it's do bacon I see on bacon? It. Yeah, no, 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 no. I see. It's not like I don't know what red is. Um, yeah. it's actually that my red receptors are filled with green. Um, no, I'm sorry. My red cones are filled with green receptors. Mm -hmm. So you get to do that little dot test where you can't read the number. I can't read the number yeah. whatsoever. But I can throw see... up that dot test. <laughs> Boom, there it is. She can't see it. So you are partially colorblind. Yes. And you've eaten dog food. Yeah. Are you a dog? No. Oh! <laughs> oh my. Are you a dog? I've never introspected and asked that question before. See, now you're thinking of something that you've never thought before. We just, be, we just went full circle on this damn thing. Oh my. Full mother flippin' circle, players. Almost got nice. it. Oh, nice. you know what? Shoot. It was, her, to it anyway. was her topic. I didn't let her try and hit oh, the, the lens. That's very rude of me. <laughs> that person's question. Oh, Goodbye. very close. Oh. You hit uh, Owen in the junk, though, Sorry. so good job. Uh, Will, you were younger than anyone? Right. Unless you have something else that you haven't, nah. that you thought of, that like other people don't think of? I don't think, I couldn't think of it because how would I know? You just incepted me. I just got inceptioned. <laughs> I have no idea what I don't think about that people do. Uh, from Caroline, Caroline, Caroline. Caroline Hacks. Sweet Caroline Hacks. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> At Source Fred Nerd, name one article of clothing that's worn out but you refuse to get rid of. Mine would be 10 year old track pants. <laughs> I have a pair of uh, Columbia Falls High School Wildcat football shorts. And you can tell how old they are because they say 2,000 on them. 2,000. <laughs> it's 14. They're like they're like John Stockton type football warm up shorts too. So they're like they're they're super sexy. Wow. <laughs> I refuse to get rid of my high school sexy shorts. Let's see. An article. I don't, I don't know if I should say this, 
But actually, if you ever see me in person, I will 90% of the time be wearing black pants because I own several pairs of black pants. You're a black pantsman. I, I only wear black pants and have these one blue pair of pants that look exactly like this, but they're dark blue, dark blue, but. And uh, one time I was like, I will wear these these pants for as many days in a row until someone says any it says anything. Nobody said nobody anything. said it. Nobody thing. ever says anything about jeans. You can no. wear jeans every day for a month, which I do here at SourceFed, <laughs> or a year, which I have probably done at one point yeah. in my life. I did two a weeks. Year. Two you weeks. don't notice jeans. You I don't. guess that's true. They all kind of look the same. And they just yeah. look like way more awesome the more worn out and dirty that's they get. True. So. That's but there true. are fashion trends though, like um, straight leg pants versus boot leg versus flare. I guess you really don't know. I hate boot, boot cut now. Really? I, do boot yeah, cut. I, I thought those were the only ones that really yeah. existed mm -hmm. anymore. Well, I used to love boot cut. Oh no, they're skinny jeans also, now. Also, right. these these pair of shoes I oh. borrowed from a friend, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna wear these every single day. And they've been destroyed. There's, they look comfy, though. They, they are still very comfy. Look good. I will be wearing them tomorrow and the next day mm -hmm. and the next day. And we'll try. I have, <laughs> the next day. I have a future uh, article of clothing that I want to be the article of clothing that I wear all the time and way too much, and that's a pair of cowboy boots. I want a pair of cowboy boots um, so bad. Me too. So bad. I've never had a pair of my own, and I've never wanted a pair of my own until like the last year. Joe, they just look so damn comfortable. I've heard they're this. the most comfortable, right? <laughs> yeah. That would perfect your whole. Look, maybe I, I mean they would ask. not match anything else because I'm not like rustic or rugged yeah. in that sense. <laughs> but man, I just want some cowboy boots really bad. You that, can have them, you know. Well, you no. Just, <laughs> why? why not? There's I got families. To, cowboy boots are expensive. I'm not gonna get some crappy like um, run of the mill bullshit pair. What, I'm like gonna $200? get two hundred dollars. They're they're expensive. worth it. They're like three hundred, dude. Worth more. it. I, I I know they'll be worth it, and one day I will be able to afford that. But now is not that time because I have a baby and it eats oh, formula. Yeah. Oh, are you gonna get the ones with the what are they spokes? The, the spurs. <laughs> on the, on the spurs. My I would rock spurs only on special formal occasions. Uh, but I will, they won't be snakeskin. I think they're just gonna be like a classy brown that I can get dirty. That's beautiful. But I can also, uh, you know, wear to a formal event, like in an ironic <laughs> sense. I'm jumping on that train. I'm jumping. Wouldn't on the train. You, if you want you some cowboy yes, boots, right? I want some boots. I also want a hat, but I know yeah, that I can't wear the hat. That's too much. I can't wear the hat unless I'm like camping or you know out in the river or something, fishing with my kids. Like I know oh, that won't cute. be an everyday thing, mm. but man, I, I'm like I just want to go half cowboy to where if I wear that <laughs> stuff around. Actual cowboys, they'll beat the shit out of me. Imagine what my game with the ladies would do if I walked up into the club I never go to with some cowboy boots. You mm -hmm. have to have the persona to pull it off, though. You like, need kind of that like southern draw. Yeah, you can't just sit at a table. You gotta. Yeah. Oh. You, gotta you put look. your feet up on everything. It doesn't matter Everything. where you're sitting or where. I'm you're at, at the White House. What's up, Obama? Boom. And he's Stepping like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> and he's like, it's okay. You it's okay. Uh, the boots. Let me be clear. Uh, you can do that because uh, it's you. I really appreciate uh, the I, I guess, Dad, I can do that. Oh, <laughs> what? Oh, you didn't know he's my father. Yeah. Yeah. No, I didn't. Anything else? Do you have any other like clothes that you wear? I have a weird. Um, I don't have it anymore, sadly. But I had these pair of combat boots that I loved and I wore them th all throughout middle school and high yeah. school and then my mom hated them and she threw them out without my knowing but she took a picture of them for me because she knew I was going to get upset so she took a picture of, of them. her burning them ah. no just of the boots that she was like sorry had to burn them throw them out okay I said burn because wow. you said burn but she was straight up like sorry I had to throw them out so here you go <laughs> and so I have a I picture that, of that's... those boots that's worse, right? It's really mean. She didn't tell you. She took a uh, man. I, feel I know like it was really mean. That's pretty low, it's mom. Like the picture it'll last longer. That's exactly, <laughs> I think, what she wanted to tell me. And it's not true. It's not. <laughs> it's, not it's not true. Not it true. did not last longer. Uh, moving on to Colton Brezinski from the Twitters. He says, if you could get all of the nutrients you need to stay healthy from pills, would you still eat food for pleasure? Hell Fuck yeah, yeah. Lord. Come on. I've, for most of my eating is in. Uh, the, the taste gets me sometime with the pickles and whatnot. But a lot of it, I'm, I'm a very big texture guy. Mm. Like I enjoy biting mm. into a crisp apple. Mm. I enjoy feeling the life of the buffalo or the cow squeeze between my teeth as I rip the flesh apart and swallow it. You've had and buffalo. take that life force. I have. Mm. Really? Oh, okay. Yeah. 
I don't Buffalo know. burgers? Oh man. I don't Give know. Me some. I'm weird with food. Like I never realized that I'm like starving until I like have a burrito in my hands. I'm like, oh, I was about to die and then I just <laughs> eat it. And you're like, Is it the smell? We yeah, like, oh, it smells yeah. like yeah. Mm. Needed so, that. I don't know. If I just had pills, I'd probably forget about it, even though I do love eating food too though. Like cheesecake, the consistency thing. Some people hate oh. cheesecake. I'm like, that is just like a warm thing. cocoa. I don't wanna give that up. I don't want to give a, up a warm cocoa on a cold winter's night. Mm, Heck no. Mmm, mm, cocoa. Ah, steak. Cocoa ah, and steak. steak. I'm good on steak. But, yeah. You don't really like steak? I'm not a big steak person. Oh, is it like, like a red meat thing? Like, I'm not, it's just at Chipotle, they're like, chicken and a steak. I'm like, chicken. Like, mm. I'm good. Like, what's, what's with the steak? Why pay an extra 50 cents or something? Like, It's weird. You never know what place you're going into. Like, sometimes they charge more for the chicken and sometimes they charge more. They do? They charge more yeah. for chicken? Yeah, I see it. Once in a while. I've not seen that. They better not. Don't, That's upsetting. Don't chickens are there's hella chickens. So <laughs> there's hella chickens. There's hella chickens. There's hella chickens. There's hella chickens. How many pigs are there? It's, it's, what is the steak? Is it steak cow? Steak is cow. <laughs> How many there's more chickens than there are cows? Therefore, I know economy. I am Obama's son. There are more cow there are more chickens than cows, so chicken should be less expensive. Oh, okay, I get it. I That's see like what you're the saying. Chick-fil-A billboards where the cows are like eat more chicken. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, That's exactly That's an adorable marketing campaign. Yeah. Kill this thing. <laughs> Kill the other this thing, thing instead. So this thing doesn't die. <laughs> <laughs> Murder no. our friends. Let me see. Over in farmland. I don't know what to do. Hygiene. Animal farm. Political animals. Leo D. Hart at SourceFed Nerd. If you could own a DeLorean, magic carpet, invisible cloak, or a TARDIS, which one would wear first? Let's, let's go over that. I'm pretty again. sure the TARDIS would also allow me to go around any universe that I yeah. wanted, yeah. any parallel existence, and I could get all those other things. Because apparently, according to the man that rides in the TARDIS, all this shit exists! Yeah. I love yes. Doctor Who, but there's no freaking rules in that universe. No, there are none. There Absolutely are none. none. If there's a plot, hole that needs to be dug, it's, they'll just do it. It doesn't matter, they can do whatever the frick they want in that yeah. show, and they do, and I enjoy it. Why would I want a magic carpet? I mean, well. Do you want to fly? Do you want to feel the wind in your No, hair? it's cold or hot. 100% <laughs> invisible cloak. Mm. It has to be a TARDIS. Like, yeah. it's just everything. The TARDIS because is an invisible cloak. It. Yeah, it, it is an invisible cloak. It has all those things. Yeah, there's, wait, is it only those options? Can there be yeah. like DeLorean, another secret? Magic Carpet, clo or Invisible Cloak. Oh. Or a TARDIS. Oh, well, okay, Let's TARDIS. Say we I love how the TARDIS. extra question and, and is, and where, where first, first? Because TARDIS is the obvious answer. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they know the answer. Yeah, no one would get a DeLorean. I mean, well, DeLoreans are fun. Now you, CJ, go. A DeLorean out. is just the prototype for the TARDIS. For the yeah. TARDIS. <laughs> That's all and it is. Doesn't it run out of gas or something? Yeah, yeah doesn't it break and then you're stuck yep. there and yep. you gotta date your mom or something? <laughs> uh, On that note. Yeah, I mean, is there, yeah, where would you go first if you, I guess, uh, yeah. Where That's the other first? thing. We don't know when there's a TARDIS. I don't know. You, you could end up time. in freaking hell. I'd be like, <laughs> oh, John Lennon, don't go over there. Don't talk to that fan, John Lennon. And from what I can tell, it's just a crapshoot. They don't know where they're going half the time. The TARDIS is just like, well, now you're in this demon's yeah. asshole. Like, all right, well, let's figure it out, Doctor. And oh, then they Zane. do. I guess that is kind of scary. And then the companion's screwed eventually in the long run. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so there's nowhere that we kind yeah. of I would not go that far, go. though, yeah. <laughs> Um, Cheyenne Moore at Shayzil. 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 My bad. Sorry. At SourceFed, your whole life. Wait. Your whole life. Would you rather be the most attractive but smell horrible, or be really ugly and smell amazing? Be really ugly and smell really amazing. Really ugly. I'm not that far off. I want to be really ugly and smell amazing. I think scent matters. I'm really grossed out by scents. You are a dog. You are oh, a dog. Oh my god. <laughs> This is amazing. This is a weird tabletop. Whoa. Cardboard. <laughs> I didn't know. What? Cardboard. Bark. What did I just say in dog? I'm sorry. Did you say bark bark? I said bark bark. Oh, man. <laughs> Whoops. I think you were just racist me. towards the I dog. I think I did some real racial slurs. Just dogs now. be like bark bark, y'all. Dogs, dogs be like. All the alive. time. <laughs> All the time. Dogs be like. <laughs> dogs be like. <laughs> I saw this dog and he was all like, bark, bark. Oh, world star, world star, world star, world star. World star. World star. I'm afraid, I'm just gonna sit here. World star. Uh, we created a moment together, Yes, we did, everybody. I'm sorry. I don't remember what the freaking question was. Uh, oh, smell or look good? Would you rather be most attractive but smell bad? 
Well, you would do fine in this type of job if you were attractive and smelled like crap. But in, like, otherwise, I mean, I don't know, would your wife still be okay to snuggle uh, at I mean, night? you're not going to get a lot of snuggles with the smell bads. Yeah. But then again, you can get used to somebody's smell. You can. You <laughs> That's can. That's true. And you can't smell yourself, so. That's, is. Oh, maybe I just can't smell me then. I don't know, I'm a dog, so <laughs> apparently you, you can smell I can everything. smell everything. <laughs> <laughs> There are definite advantages to both situations. I would like. I'm thinking that in the world that we are living in, uh, the the most beneficial thing for you would be to be attractive. That's true, because realistically, you could just deodorize. Yeah, you can no. stop a smell. You can stop. You can't but stop your face. If you're like soup, you said like mega ugly or yeah. something. Yeah, like <laughs> no, I didn't say mega like, ugly, but like I'm not spending money on surgeries. Really ugly and smell amazing. Yeah, you could surgically amazing. get those scent glands. How's taken my out. personality doing if I'm ugly? like a ferret? I think Am that's I the same what we on have the to contemplate. I don't got enough to work with that, so I'm gonna go with the sm the smell bad, but look good. Really? I can fix it. Huh? Yeah. No, you're right. Okay. I mean, maybe you can mask it. With, I can, you can but mask the other it. way, you can, you can wear a mask. You, you can, can wear some mask. You can mask it, or you can mask it. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Last one. Here we go. Last one. Feel free to hit the lens there. Oh, it, was it was a curve. I'm, 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 I can't throw. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, Adam Sexy Buzzard from Reddit says, if you could have one Mario Kart weapon installed into your car, <laughs> what would you choose? Lightning bolts? Oh, they're all going to be Lightning sure. bolt would be pretty fun, but For you sure. would murder a lot of people. I'm yeah. pretty sadistic. You would murder everybody. I would murder everyone. I would find you as your tiny self. And Lightning I bolt would... would be pretty cool. You, oh, you got uh, it. I got it. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Lightning bolt's good. I like the idea of uh, star power. Is pretty sweet. That's what um, I was thinking. But you just all of these kill people. So? All of these are gonna hurt everyone. <laughs> like if you're in LA traffic and you're like stop and go and you put on your uh, your thing, <laughs> boom, 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 boom. That's yep. like twelve murders in ten seconds. I mean, there's also like the the super power like uh, mega. Turbo mushroom with like 400 ones that you can just. Oh yeah, with yeah. This, yeah. Oh, and then oh, you're oh, just the gonna mushroom. kill yourself. But don't yeah. you spin out if you do it too much? Like you do. No, not that mm -hmm. one. That one doesn't spin you out. Oh. The turbo mushroom. Well, I mean, if you suck, you'll spin if out no matter suck. what. But... Yeah, this is a very like horrible. Like we're gonna kill somebody. Yeah, you're gonna <laughs> kill somebody. <laughs> Inner spree killer. Nothing doesn't hurt anyone. Oh. Yeah, everything. I want the spiked can, turtle shell too. I just, I just don't. But like that's people. just gonna hit someone in the first. The spiked, I know. The spiked turtle <laughs> shell would only be good for those situations. You guys ever been on the freeway when the cops freaking stop everybody? Oh, when they go like this oh. and then they do this in front yeah. of everybody mm -hmm. for about 15 minutes and then then they hold up traffic for sometimes there's a wreck up ahead or sometimes I think it's just to disperse traffic. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, to disperse you know, traffic. I'd blue shell that motherfucker. So <laughs> the cops. God, there's <laughs> nothing worse than like I, I gotta get to a place and then I see this guy start mm -hmm. doing this. Man, I'm not police. a cop killer though. Mm -hmm. I would hope that maybe he just like off the side of the oh road like they tend to do in the game and then come back. The little and ghost then, picks And then up. life, oh, like yeah, in yeah. stupid Mario Kart Wii, which is the worst freaking Mario Kart, doesn't matter how good you are because if you're a skilled player, you just get raped by the game. <laughs> like, like the AI just like goes up a thousand levels and kills you. You have to suck at Mario Kart Wii to win at Mario Kart Wii. Mm. That game is Dumb. Dang, you had a lot of thoughts what about that. What a weird rant. It's not dumb, it's kind of fun. <laughs> it's I couldn't get into it. You'd always win if you were Baby Peach on a bike. Oh, is that the rule? Uh, not the rule, but it's kind of like a Is a that just hacks. your favorite? No, 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 no. It's, um, she's the lightest, and the bike um, lets you cut curves faster oh, or better or something that. like that. We just learned something. Yeah. I went so from try. a place of anger. She went from a place of intelligence. Wow. Well, um, Making things happy. <laughs> Making things happy. Kind of like a dog. <laughs> uh... Oh. <laughs> like a dog. <laughs> and on that, we're done. We're going to end on a mystery, kind of. Did we solve it? Did we solve it? I don't know. <laughs> you don't have any boots. Get Dang it. <laughs> hey, guys, uh, if you want to participate next time, please submit some topics out on the Twitters or the Reddits. Uh, my name is Joe Beretta. I'm William Haynes. I'm Raina Scully. That was fast. Really Don't clap for yourself. Don't clap for yourself. <laughs> I didn't know you were clapping for me. Oh, that's you're just looking that's in my direction. I was clapping for me. She came up very egotistical clapping for herself, but it was also a really cool dog trick. What? Oh, <laughs> oh no! I really am a dog! <laughs> <laughs>